The Beat 99.9 FM. What your radio craves. When this had come down to Nigeria, we do not even have an argument that we're going to get married. And if you watch the show, out of the six couples, we are the only one that will get married. Uh -huh. So, and I did that just to make her happy. Wow, okay. Y you know, so after she goes back and she knows that I made a lot of sacrifice, go and watch, go and see all my families, my friends, nobody's happy. But I say, hey, gentlemen, it's my life. I'm ready to make this woman happy. Mm -hmm. And uh, now she's here crying that well, let's just get this married. I know that I'm doing something for her. And I was thinking she will understand I'm doing that for her. But after she go back, she start calling me scammer. Wow. She even called me N-word. Wow. You can't know? say that on air. Yeah, I have to. No, you cannot. Okay, but keep on going. Okay, she called me N-word. I thank you very much. Yes. You know, so, you know, after saying that, I was like, I think it is time for me to let this woman understand that I'm not a prisoner, mm -hmm. I'm not a slave, mm -hmm. and I'm not doing this for anything just to make her happy. Mm -hmm. I say, go back and tell the world. For that and what you call me apologize because it was even that time that they were you know the whole world was protesting for George Floyd killing oh wow you know so I was like go back and apologize and she was like no she was angry that's why because she usually do that whenever we had any problem Lisa would just go on social media he says come on yeah, and then she come back and what pay me the most is that if you want to come here is come please bring something to prove that I scam you uh -huh. you know I make better life here in Nigeria than the American life that she's living over there. I swear to God. Mm -hmm. You know? I'm here in Nigeria driving a car that was like six to seven million naira. Despite that we don't have a company that produces car. Yeah. You are in America where they produce car and even sell it at a cheaper rate. You are riding a car that is like what? 600 to 500 to 600 oh, million. Wow. <laughs> you living for the whole 52 years, you living your life in a rent house, which we have guys that go to struggle and they, they own their own houses. You live in there with, you know, a rent house for a very long time till today and you see calling me, I scam you. How much do you make in a week? If you make like $1,000 in a week in America, you don't make money. Yikes. If you make that money in Nigeria, you make money because of the exchange rate. Mm -hmm. But if you make that kind of money in America, you don't make money because you have bills, you have tax. Mm -hmm. So if you minus bills and tax from $1,000, it's not your money, I'm telling you. All right, so why did you even go for her? Because you guys you said you were dating with her. You were dating her two years before the show even started. Yes, yes. So how did that even happen? How did you meet her? Why did you even pursue her? I met her through a friend. There's a friend called Marino. She's from UK. Okay. And I met UK in Tanzania. That you was, met UK? Yeah, I met I met Marino okay. in Tanzania. All right. That was around 2013, right? Yeah, 2013 or 2013 or 14. I went for a concert and I was invited as an African artist. Mm -hmm. I represent uh, Nigeria. Mm -hmm. So, and uh, we, we met with Marino there, and Marino was like, What kind of language? Because I sang in my tongue, you know, sometimes oh, I, I mix it up. So, okay. yeah, so she was like, She was happy, she was interested. From there, we exchanged number, we start talking. After she go back to UK and I come back to Nigeria, we continue to continue being friends. Mm -hmm. Then she said, I have a friend called Lisa, she's in America, I'm going to share right. her to you. She share her page to me, and I text her. Hello, what's up? My name is so so, and I got you from. She said she is your friend. Nice to meet you, and that's one. Yeah. And from there we start talking. Then Lisa was like, baby, blah blah, and that's how all it started. But when you saw her, you knew she was a divorcee. You knew she was older than you. You saw her picture now. Were you feeling her from before? Were you feeling her back then? And then it just fizzled out. Or were you never really feeling her? There was no feeling in a romantic way for me to Lisa. There was no feeling. There was no feeling. Are you in serious? In a romantic thing. Okay. Get it right. Sorry. There is no any romantic feeling uh -huh. from me to Lisa. Uh -huh. But there is a pity feeling that I know she stick on me and she loved me because she attempted to commit suicide twice. And this is the reason why I'm telling you that I'm doing this for pity. Whoa. It's not nice to say that. But if I didn't say that, people would be like, this guy is just bullshitting everybody here. I'm telling you. You can't thing. swear oh, on I'm air. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm Go sorry. ahead. Continue. <laughs> you know, so... If I didn't say that people were like, because this impression that everybody got, that once you are an African, especially in Nigeria, you're using the yeah, yeah. green card, yeah. Man, if you go to America, you're not going to be sleeping on your bed and the government will be giving you food and everything. Mm -hmm. You will have to work. Mm -hmm. So if I have to work, why would I go to a place where I don't even know how to work? While I have here, I'm working and I'm making things happening here. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. I don't need green card, I'm telling you. And even if there's anybody from the embassy hearing me that, don't give me green card if I get to United States. Just give me visa, let me go there and do what I have to do and come back. All right. You think you, if you give the video, if you take the video and put him in White House in America, he will stay? He will not. Mm -hmm. Take whiskey, diamond planner from Tanzania. 
Mr. Easy, all of them. That is the kind of heart I have, man. Mm-hmm. I want to be who I want to be, not that I want to go there and be a, you know, you know, restaurant cleaner and come back here and start looking. No. I'm gonna read you something that she said, and I want you to either say yes or no to it. So see what you think about it. What's that? So she said this, and I quote: "He married me just to be on a TV show so that people will recognize his name to sell his music." What do you have to say about that? I don't do that. Honestly, it's no. It's capital no. I do not marry her just because of a TV show. Okay. I marry her because she tried to commit suicide if I did not stay with her. Mm-hmm. That is the truth. Okay. And that is why I keep on saying that even after the show, when she goes back and she start calling me names, I tell the world that if she say that, she can go and live her life. Let me go and live my life. I make sacrifice, you know, living with Lisa. That is the truth. I just live with Lisa for sacrifice, just to make her happy. Yeah. And that was the reason why I said after marrying her, I have to go and get another marriage because I need my own happiness too. Wow. You understand? There was a time in the show where she caught you texting somebody and telling them that you love them. Is that something you were pursuing romantically? I think I think I still have that chat. Really? Yeah. Tell us about what it. happened was that that lady was like a friend. Okay. But she turned a friend. Uh-huh. And um I think I have right to be friend with anybody I feel like I want to be friend with. Mm-hmm. So the lady started, you know, developing like a love. But from when she started, I told her it's not going to work. I be, I tell you this and I'll repeat. Mm-hmm. I have not any in Nigeria here being an artist. I have, you know what it takes to be an artist. Mm-hmm. Not any lady that will come out and say, I am so just boy girlfriend. Wow. Not because I don't want, uh-huh. but because I don't want to just be distracted. You know? So you're telling her that you loved her, that was just a casual friendship thing. Are you telling me that if Whiskey say I love you, he means that he love you for dating? <laughs> That's the point. You are an artist. Somebody say he love you. Uh-huh. Then you tell him, okay, thank you. No. Text me you love me, I'll tell you I love you too. And you know what I mean. Yeah, it yeah, doesn't I, mean I, that I, I love you, you because I, I want to get you. It just make you happy. I love you, I love you, I get if, that. If this this girl I stay in Kaduna uh-huh. and this girl she stay in Kaduna. And anytime she tell me that um, I want to see you. I'll tell her that I'm not even staying in Kaduna. I'm staying in Kano just to avoid her. So if I really want to stay with wow. that lady, it's easy. Hey, come and meet me in social place, and uh, we'll do whatever we want to do. If there's anything that we have to do, okay. So it's not. It's not. Lisa is like I don't know. Maybe there is a different way of thinking between the Americans and Africans. Mm-hmm. But I believe entertainment is one in the whole world. And um, I make thirty thousand dollars as at that time. So I appointed her to get because she also worked on with Kano. Yeah. So I was like, since I don't have American bank account, I was like, Lisa, get the money from them and send it to me. Uh-huh. I told her what I want to do with the money so that she will understand how urgent I need the money. And I'm not asking her to give me the money. It is my own money. Mm-hmm. So I said, get the money because I'm not in the state. And these people cannot do a wire transfer to me. Get the check, mm-hmm. send the money to me. She said that she promised she was going to send the money within 24 hours. After she get the $26,000, she buy a car, Dodge Charger. What? And um, everything changed. So I was like, okay, you've been calling me scammer now. You scam me. Yeah, you're the real so scammer fine. here. Yeah, so fine. If really this is how is it going to be, we have to cut it off. Wow. And that's what happened. So <laughs> after the pressure, because after she did that, then I go back, you know, on my IG and I did a live on my IG, and the whole world knows what 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 was going on. Mm-hmm. And um, it turns out good because. The main point for me is that not the money. Mm-hmm. It's not that I have money, I'm not a rich person, but at least my reputation is important because I know if I'm making thousands of dollars from now, in future I'm going to make millions of dollars. Exactly. So exactly. no problem. Since you call me scammer, you call me serious. I mean you call me times times without number. We know what she called you. Don't say it again. <laughs> so now you scam me, it's alright. Mm-hmm. You can go on with the money. Keep it, I'll like, make yeah, more. Yeah, I'll make more. And um, the one who understand who is who now. All right. So that was her. But after the prayer, you know, a lot of people were, you know, putting so much prayer on her. She now sent me five thousand dollars out of twenty six thousand four hundred and seventy three US dollars. So where's the rest? She ate it, and um, she ate it, and um, I leave it with her. So, but no problem. She can take the money in as much as she's living her life, and I'm living my own life. No problem. That's Life crazy. is like that, you know. You we, we learn from our mistakes. Yeah, you have to. So I learned my lesson in a high currency. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it's true. But it's okay. You make it back. Yeah. So next question or final question for the day. Thank you so much for sticking with us. Yeah. What is next for you, Soldier Boy? Um, the next for me is that um, as everybody knows, I'm an artist. Yeah. I sing, 
um i am expecting i i will say that the fans should expect a you know a very hot banger coming out okay and uh i have a one of the best african star on my track you know it is coming Tell us out now. soon. No, I'm not gonna. Ginger Oz. I'm not gonna. Give but us I'm a first name. But I'm telling you, <laughs> if we have three hot Africans, he's mm. among. Oh wow! If we have three hot Africans Afri- or Nigerians. African. You okay, know, okay. The whole African music is from Nigeria, you know. Ah, that's not fair. To no, say. it's not fair. But I'm saying that the major of it is from Africa. We have Tanzania. We have Ghana. We have. Uh-huh. But if you are talking about three hot Africans, artists, that guy have to be among them. So it's I didn't mention the name. <laughs> it can be whiskey, it can be bona, it can be David, it can be diamond, it can be Sakoli. But it's very, 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 very hot. Okay, okay, we're waiting on that. Yeah, and I'm, I'm dropping my EP by November, God Swilling. And again, something big is coming, even bigger than that. Are you going to tell us? No, I'm not going to tell you. Why are you now getting us excited? The reason why I'm doing this is that if I tell you what am I going to do now, when it come out, you'll be like, I know about this. But when it take you by surprise, mm. that is when you, oh my god, so you is this guy like you know. So and um, may I believe in that? Don't tell the plan, but show the result. All right, all right. Yeah. Before I let you go, one last question: How yeah. is your love life now? Oh my god, is is the best. I'm living the best life right really? now. Really? Yeah. What? From the past and present, it is the best. But I believe the future is coming with bigger things. So 